Attention all units, attention all units. Today we lower our flags to half staff. A moment of silence. We recall their courage, compassion, and dedication to duty. To honor the lives lost on September 11th, 2001. So we gather to remember the victims of that heinous act, but also their families and their friends who still grieve today. Nearly 3,000 people were killed on 9-11 after terrorists hijacked and crashed four passenger planes. The images of the planes hitting the World Trade Center in New York City and then the Pentagon and another crashing in a field in southwest Pennsylvania are seared into the memory of Americans, including Louisville Mayor Craig Greenberg. Greenberg's grandfather had previously served as a firefighter in New York City. Even though my grandfather had retired decades before 2001, Engine 207 was on the scene at the World Trade Center that day. Members of Engine 207 died on 9-11. In total, more than 400 first responders died that day as they rushed to Ground Zero to help survivors. Thousands thousands of lives that were saved because of the efforts of the firefighters and the police officers to evacuate as many as they could from those towers before they fell. And Governor Bashir says as we mourn the lives lost, we also pay tribute to the brave men and women who responded on 9-11 in an act of service to the country. Because while terrorists cowardly act may have succeeded in creating a spectacle of destruction, their overall goal was dividing us and that failed miserably. Americans did not fold. Instead, we came together to confront this threat and to rebuild together. Jamie Mays, WLKY News.